Yeah. Baby cakes, you just don't know, know how I, I, I like no, no, no. Baby Cakes Beauty 101 and for today's video I'm going to be doing what is on my iPhone and I've been wanting to do this video for a really really long time since I got my first iPhone in like 2014, 2015, something like that so yeah so I have had an iPhone 4S and I now have an iPhone 5S and this is what mine looks like it's just a black one and the back of it is like silver and yeah if you want to see what's on mine let's just jump right into the video so this is like my lock screen, what my phone looks like from the outside. It's just a picture of me and my friend at a show we did and yeah. So then you just open the iPhone and it brings you onto the like main page. Okay so on my phone I have four kind of like main screens. So my first one is kind of like the stuff that comes like with the phone. Then I have like my social media kind of stuff and then I have photography and editing and then some like games. So I'm just gonna start. So I'm just gonna start with the first screen. So this screen is just where I keep the stuff that I use that comes on the iPhone. So yeah, I just have calendars, photos, camera, clocks, calculator, notes, um, weather, app store, Safari, iBooks, voice memo, settings, iTunes store, contacts, mail, and then I have this app here called Battery Doctor, and this just gets rid of like the attached files and stuff that is on your phone that you don't need and take up so much space. Then I have a folder here called other stuff and in here is just stuff that I don't really use as often so I have reminders, maps, compass, health, find my iPhone, wallet, FaceTime, watch, Crowdfire which is an app that sends automatic DMs on Twitter. Then I have Bitmoji for Snapchat, I have the Subway app, eBay app, Boots app, WhatsApp and the Ryanair app. And out of these, the one I basically only use is health, just to see how many steps I've taken in a day. So this is today, and yeah, I've done 7,000, but I was in school all day, so yeah. Then along the bottom here, I just have my music. I have messages, phone, and PocketTube, which is another app for music. So then on this screen here, I just have like my kind of social media stuff. So first of all, I have Instagram, because Instagram is life. You guys should go follow me on there because I post a lot and I really love my Instagram. I just think the colours are really nice together and yeah, you should follow me. So now I have Facebook which is private. I have Snapchat, I have a public one and a private one. So my YouTube one is in the description box and yeah, you should follow me on there. Then I have YouTube, um, Messenger, Twitter which you should also follow me on. Um, I'm cool and I post some stuff. So yeah. Then I have Pinterest which is also linked in the description box. I have Gmail, I have YouTube Studio which is like I can check my comments and how my channel is on that. I have Google Plus, Shazam, Musical.ly which is linked below. Then I have Hexatech and this is just an app for when your Wi-Fi is kind of like low and not good. Um, you can connect this and it makes your Wi-Fi much stronger. I use it in school a lot. Then I have an app called Video Lab, and when I bought it, it was broken from like day one and when you go into it, it just like jumps back out but I refuse to delete it because I paid for it. Then I have an app here called Makeup Plus which I use sometimes to edit my Instagram photos. Then I have Documents which I can download music for my YouTube videos. And then I have an app here called Sim Simi and this was like an old app and then it came to life in my school there a couple of weeks ago. And yeah, basically you can anonymously anonymously um, say like bad things or good things about people and they don't know who it is. So basically you just type in your own name or someone else's name and you can either see what people are writing about you or you can write things about other people. But yeah, I just got to see what people are writing bad stuff about me. They weren't. But yeah, then my next kind of page is like photography, editing, stuff like that. So I have iMovie, an app called Fast Slow, I have Fonto for my thumbnails, I have PW Lite which is like you can take the background off a picture off if that makes sense. Then I have Retrika Pro which I haven't used since I was like 13 but also I paid like 15 euro for it so it's not going anywhere. Then I have Wittagram which puts white borders on your Instagram pictures, I have Square Ready Video, I have Picolage, I have Beauty Plus which is another editing app for my Instagram pictures. I have um, Pocket Video, which is what I make my 
video intros on the whole baby cakes. Yeah, that one. Then I have this one, and it's U M U N. I don't know U N U M. But basically, you can lay out your whole Instagram, and you can like put in a picture to see what it look good. You know, like with your team. So here's some pictures here um, that I was just trying one time. So basically, I can just pull down, let's say this one, and see does it go well with my team. And I can move it around and stuff like that just to see just to see will it look good you know with my Instagram and it looks fine so yeah so on my next and last slide here I just have Candy Crush which I'm sure you all know what that is but I'm sure none of you still play it I love it I went off it for like two years because I was stuck on this level but then I passed the level and I'm obsessed with it so yeah I like love Candy Crush so much. I am on level 879, so yes. Then I have Piano Tiles 2, and then I have an app called Stack, which is like that game, it was called like Tower Blocks or something. It used to come on like Nokia phones and stuff. But basically, that's not it, that's not. Basically what you do is, hold on. You get a square and you have to like line them up with each other. And when you miss, like I am, a bit cuts off. So you have to get it on the same thing every time. And then it starts growing bigger. And yeah, basically that's how it's done. Then I have this app called 1010, which is my obsession. And I got a load of my friends addicted to it too. But basically it's kind of like Tetris in a way. So just press play. So yeah, you just like move the stuff around. And until like it makes a line kind of thing. And then it will clear it out. So I'm just going to throw these here but yeah just like that and then the last thing on my phone is 8 ball pool which is like a game where you can play pool with your friends or with strangers and yeah it's really fun and I really love it so yeah that's everything on my iPhone so yeah so yeah guys that's the end of the video I hope you enjoyed if you did please give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe down below and make sure you follow all my social media, they're always linked down below. And also, make sure you subscribe to my vlog channel. I did make a vlog channel, I keep saying that in all my videos. But I did make one, it's called Keeping Up With Kelly, it's going to be linked down below. And you should go subscribe because I plan on doing a lot of vlogs this summer. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!